Hello everyone and uh, uh, since the last video I showed uh, about uh, MK802 and uh, connected to uh, la uh, laptop and uh, there are so many comments asked about uh, what about the, the new version and uh, uh, MK I think is about uh, uh, it's nine, uh, 908 so and yeah, can that connect to the laptop so uh, then I I go ahead and buy a new version as uh, this is a uh, MK uh, 908 this is a old version because uh, I showed uh, as uh, MK 808 so it's a, the size is about the same and uh, uh, this is a new one with a quad core A9 processor and a better uh, uh, graphic processor and they got the two gig of memory and uh, but turns out uh, what happened was uh, uh, this new processor need higher power in order to operate so unfortunately the laptop uh, isn't that powerful enough to power this one so I did uh, several attempts to try to get this one work. So first of all, once you plug this one, you, what you found is you will find this one not even work. So let me try this. So come with this one is uh, the the USB uh, the HDMI cable will be different because it's uh, gonna use a mini HDMI uh, port. So. Uh, this cable will come with the package uh, MK908 package so what I did is just plug in this cable to regular uh, 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 HDMI port and uh, connect to uh, micro uh, HDMI port so then connect to laptop okay then I got this one connected to this port and uh, this one, because uh, the USB is different, it's USB not is not the micro USB. It's gonna be the mini USB. So, but uh, fortunately, we see a USB port. Uh, this is uh, the way uh, MK908 designed for. So I just use the regular USB, the cable I had before, and then I connect. So supposedly this this one should work, but. Take a look. What gonna happen to the screen? So you turn on. I'm trying to boot up the uh, Transmart BIOS. No, you shut down and reboot again. You shut down, reboot again. So the problem is uh, the power. So it doesn't have enough power to power this one up. Okay, so then this is the cable and come with MK908. So what I'm gonna use, I'm gonna use this cable and actually this uh, credit goes to one of the, the video viewer and uh, he mentioned about it. So I plug in this one to laptop and this side I plug in uh, MK908. Plug this one in see how this one goes it seems in the uh, booting the device and running by the way, because I'm not using uh, the Transmart uh, official BIOS, because uh, what I'm using as a, a developer and uh, who provide the update uh, BIOS and uh, more suitable to the US version, it turns out that this one is better because it wants to connect to the TV and uh, I see the screen is much, so much better. So, all right, so it's boot up. So if you notice, what's the problem is the resolution. So the resolution isn't the resolution what we expected, it's a 1080p. 
uh, the trying to display 1080p, but it will not de detect whatever the device which is laptop capable to do the, that resolution. So then we go to setting. Then we go to screen. So and take a look at the uh, output interface. So it's trying to uh, use HDMI. So that's what we expected. Then click on HDMI mode. So now take a look. It's only got uh, 720 times uh, by uh, 576p and uh, 720 times by 480p. So wh what happened is uh, the whatever the port plugging and the power and uh, trying to uh, give to the the mini PC it doesn't function it doesn't function so uh, it just uh, can't detect what the actual screen resolution and got this one work so I so at this point I don't think uh, it's suitable to use uh, uh, MK9908 uh, for a uh, laptop so probably we wait for the next room uh, room update or next version so trying to get that one work so uh, keep tuned so uh, I will provide more update about this one thank you